And we start our show today with that. Door dash. I am hungry, and you are dashing to my door to get me food. I like that. Federal Express, I need this letter. I can. You're running to your planes to get it to my house. Apple. Every time I think of Apple, it's, I love apples. They're healthy. They're cold. They're fresh. Names matter. It's the first thing you think about, right? Get me food dashing to my door. I like it. My NFL guys didn't like Lamar Jackson. Bill Polian, Hall of Famer, thought he was a receiver. He's just different. And when things are different, they are hard to get your arms around, right? But what if we change the name of the position from quarterback, and it was called playmaker. Wide receiver, running back, tight end, left guard, playmaker. Because they do take the snap 65 times a game. And they have to make plays. They have to make audibles. They have to run. They have to be able to throw. If you call the position playmaker, we would all agree Lamar Jackson's top three in the league. And he is winning at 81%. That is top three in the league. Last night, he had 200 passing yards, 100 rushing yards, two rushing touchdowns. Only two players in league history have done that. He is a nightmare to face because, like Kyler Murray, he is a playmaker. We just don't know what to do with different people and different experiences. That's why the name matters. Because the rules now are allowing for quarterbacks to make more plays. In college, the spread offenses, college quarterbacks are making more plays. And as Bill Parcells always said, you are what college football gives you. He is a playmaker. And here's what's interesting is that when anybody's great at one thing, I mean truly great, Lamar's legs, Lamar's speed, you don't have to be great at everything. Uh, I had a friend once go to the late Whitney Houston, a concert. I said, oh, how was it? She said, she was so so boring. She just just stood on stage. And I'm like, yeah, when you're Whitney Houston, don't, don't dance around. Just sit there and sing because you have the greatest voice in the history of the world. She goes, well, she didn't move around. And I'm like, yeah, because she has the greatest voice in the history of the world. Like Lamar Jackson is so great at moving and making plays, he doesn't need to be Brady. Why did we not criticize Drew Brees, who was so accurate, he didn't need a big arm because he could wedge that ball in a keyhole. Peyton Manning was so smart pre-snap, his giant brain, he didn't have to have a beautiful arm. He would get people in the right position. Lamar Jackson is so gifted, so fast, he doesn't need to be Tom Brady throwing the football down the field. The other thing about Lamar is that when you are a playmaker, you create your own inertia. I'll give you an example. So let's say I told you today that uh, Travis Kelsey and Tyreek Hill are out next week for... The Chiefs. Even with Patrick Mahomes, you'd be like, well, it's not going to be the same offense. If I told you tomorrow, yes, Stephon Diggs won't play for the Bills next week, Cole Beasley out, you'd be like, oh, well, well, he won't be as good. With Lamar, he lost his entire backfield a couple weeks ago. It's like, eh, it doesn't really matter. He had the ball 36 minutes last night because when you're a playmaker, you create your own inertia and your own momentum. That he's really not as dependent as a Brady or a Mahomes or a Josh Allen on great teammates. He creates his own plays. Just change the name of the position to playmaker, and I think we would all agree. There's just nothing on the planet that looks like that. Uh, that there is, there is. And by the way, he talked John Harbaugh into going for it on fourth down. What did he do to seal the win? He made a play. Here's Lamar. You know, in my mind, I'm like, damn, we should go for it because we close. But then when I went to go into the side, I was like, you want to go for it? I'm like, hell yeah. I'm like, no doubt. Like, and we did. You know, we, got, we came out with success. Yeah, I mean, he really controlled the game last night. 36 minutes, time of possession.